The electric vehicles are a great alternative to the petrol cars. They help lower the carbon footprint and they are easy to run. By 2040, most of the new cars that arrived in the market will be electric vehicles. That's the requirement and the consumer demand. And based on the environmental conditions, the environmental friendly development in the automobile industry that bring this transformative changes to happen and the most of the country will be a zero emission in the transport sector mainly the car segment which makes the electric vehicle a perfect option based on the energy efficiency the low maintenance cost easy to access easy to handle and that makes those a huge interest in the public the user as the electric car goes up and that's how it look about the position of electric vehicle the industry that how it stick the charging facility of those electric vehicles at home will be great for the individuals the most electric vehicles are fully charged overnight within a six to eight hours and that will be great for the people who are using those cars in the daytime and the public rapid charge point that can return an exhausted EV to the 80% of its range in just 30 minutes. While that's not as quick as filling up with petrol or diesel, but you have driven those cars enough to need a recharge. Chances that you will want a short break anyway. And most of the cases, the public charge point connectors. In many locations, and this number goes up every year, and India also, the charging station is evolving rapidly. Uh, and the fast adoption of this electric vehicle, the automobile industry, and the transformation will boost the enhanced number of charging stations across Delhi, NCR, Mumbai, Bangalore, and Chennai, and many important cities, the metro cities in India, the massive and the highway. Road also, there are a large number of charging stations that can help to maintain the electric vehicle mobility, the advancement in this electric car segment that will a necessity a backbone that is a charging station and this development will boost the automobile industry to grow in this country and that is the ultimate reason and along with that the range of electric vehicles that has a single charge how much amount of distance it can cover, how much kilometer it can cover with a single fully charged automation, automotive car industry and how this, the most modern electric vehicle have a range that comfortably suit most of the people that daily journey and that means you can change your car at a home at a, or at a work without impacting your daily routine and for the longer journey it's good idea to use those rapid charger to top up this way that is the quickest and fastest method to charge those electric vehicles and that often find an easy bit than a car parts or petrol station or larger shopping centers and the supermarket areas where this underground section or a basement will use those charging station to charge those electric vehicles during laser time and that can be useful. The electric vehicle runs on the electricity based on electricity. Some hybrid model is there where this gasoline, petrol or diesel product along with uh, simultaneously the electric charging both will work, both parallel do those tasks for the automobile industry but Keep your cost as low as possible. It wise to make sure that the best electric vehicle tariff or plan that needs your demand, your fulfillment, and that the exclusive price that pick those electricity in adoption, the demand. No doubt that on that many moves that the electric vehicle is cheaper to run than the petrol cars. It seems so, and that's how it's cost around. A 4 paisa per mile where compared to the petrol car that cost 10 paisa per mile that figure the based on current average cost of the petrol and diesel car and that's how it will work in future that's the importance gradually it's 
generated and that comes the electric vehicle maintenance cost that's another the important types of electric vehicles the electric car that is available in the market for particularly the few different types of electric vehicles that some run purely on electricity and that's a pure electric vehicle and some are also run on petrol or diesel these are called the hybrid electric vehicle the plug in electric that means the car that runs purely on electricity and that gets all the power that it required when run that when it's plugged into the charge charging station that type does not need the petrol and diesel to run so does not produce any emissions like the traditional conventional car do the plugged in hybrid car that runs on electricity but also have a traditional fuel engine so you can use those petrol on diesel too if they run out of the charges when running on the fuel these cars will produce the emission but when they are running on electricity they won't basically the plugged in hybrids can be plugged into an electricity source to recharge their batteries this runs mainly on fuel like petrol or diesel but also have an electric battery that's a hybrid electric model which is recharged to the regenerative braking and that's how you can switch between using your fuel engine and using your electric vehicle mode at the touch of a button that cars cannot be plugged into the electricity source and that's rely on the petrol or diesel for the energy consumption the importance of electric vehicle infrastructure the development of electric vehicle infrastructure how india plan out those model to develop those infrastructure that scale up those electric vehicle adoptions that a massive adoption of electric vehicles in india and that can boost the electric vehicle sector the automobile industry and the massive amount of charging stations the large amount of electric vehicle manufacturing and many important companies that produce those electric vehicle cars whether it is a hybrid or pure electric model and that could be the game changer for the automobile industry in the next 10 to 15 years and the next decade what we call the current decade 2030 up to up to 2030 will be a game changer for electric vehicle industry and the transformation in the automobile industry will work on this infrastructure and the development of this innovative technological and commercial solutions to overcome them and that's how its existing and the future charging and infrastructure provision requirements and explore the use of new technology to manage meet and future demand in many areas including the rural areas to build the ev infrastructure and that is the electric vehicle infrastructure for the future and that creative innovative model and the solutions along with the infrastructure charging charging stations and a um, large amount of manufacturing in the hybrid and the pure electric vehicle adoptions will be a game changer for this particular industry in future that's all for now thanks for watching